the kingdom of the Jews was destroyed by who? Nebuchadnezzar. The Babylonian kingdom, they defeated the Jews in the Holy Land and they broke up their kingdom. Not only that, they took them as slaves back to Iraq in Babel, in Babylon. They took them back to Babel. And the Jews were cut off from the true religion of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. They were cut off from the scripture for quite a while. And they were under the influence and the dictatorship and the oppression and the tyranny of the Babylonians. And that is where a lot of the distortion that happened to the religion of Judaism, that is where it occurred. It occurred in Babel. Where was the Talmud written? And who wrote it? It was written by the 70 rabbis who were in Babylon. And now that is the central and the focus, that is the law and the central focus of the Yahud now. They have left the Torah and they are following the Talmud. And the Talmud was written by the rabbis who were influenced by the regime and the environment in Babylon. The other point, the issue of the temple. This temple of Suleiman is a myth. There's no such thing called temple of Suleiman. The one who built the masjid was who? Yaqub alayhi salam. Sayyidina Suleiman is the one who erected the masjid and expanded it during his kingdom. It was not a temple, it was a masjid. Let's read from Surah Al-Baqarah, Ayah, which is 101. And when there came to them a messenger from Allah, came to who? He was talking about the Yahud, the Jews. And when there came to them a messenger from Allah, confirming what was sent to them, a party of those who were given the scripture, threw away the book of Allah behind their backs as if they did not know. So they threw away the book of Allah. When Rasulullah came, because they don't want to follow him, and what did they follow? وَاتَّبَعُوا مَا تَتْلُوا الشَّيَاطِينَ عَلَى مُلْكِ سُلَيْمَانِ And they followed what the devils gave out in the lifetime of Sulaiman. What is this talking about? The devils were teaching the people magic. الشَّيَاطِينَ, the devils, were teaching the people magic before the time of Sulaiman and during the kingdom of Sulaiman. As Siddi, in his tafsir of this ayah, he says, Sulaiman came to know that the devils are teaching people magic. So he gathered all of their manuals and books. He took them away from the devils, from the people, and he made a law that whoever learns magic or practices magic or teaches magic will be executed. And he took away all of these books and manuals and he buried them, as the story goes, under his throne. He buried them.
like prescription pills when you misusing them, nigga. The Templar Knights, when they took Jerusalem, nigga, and figured out what was buried under Solomon's temple. Al-Aqsa, the name is not coincidental. Al-Aqsa, the name is not coincidental.